The next material we're going to add, it's going to be the V-Ray Edge. And the V-Ray Edge is going to be down here. It's actually called uh, V-Ray Edges Text. And what it does, it adds these uh, white edges, which I'm not going to see on the viewport, but here. And I can set the pixel width, or I can define it by wall units. The interesting thing with the wall units is that you see that in the back it's getting thinner than in the front. Okay, whether in the pixel ones, it's all the same thickness. So it looks uh, quite technical. It doesn't look like a tune object. And to have that, we actually don't have it on the materials. We have to go to the environment. That's because you are not really going to have a realistic material mixed with a tune material. The whole scene is going to be like a cartoon. Therefore, we actually leave it with the material as it is, and we go to the rendering menu, to environment, or we can actually also just press 8. And in the atmosphere, we add an effect, and there is the V-Ray tune. And now we see it here. So uh, down here are the, again, by pixels or by world. Let's say I'm going to put it in two. Okay, and I can say overlap, maybe 0.5. It's how much the lines are going to be overlapping. And the threshold is going to be 0.3. And you can just play with the values. Uh, I can change the opacity. And you can play uh, in any way you like, and you can also uh, add maps to those lines. So let's say I have one of these bitmaps, but the map is taken in all of the lines.